Hi everyone, this is Mickey with Mullen Pedal Steel Guitars in Dallas, Texas. Thanks for joining me. Uh, my good friend Jamie Lennon, and that, uh, I guess we're friends, aren't we Jamie? I think we are. <laughs> Posted on his YouTube channel a, uh, an arrangement of Help Me Make It Through the Night that was in a Martina McBride performance and Wayne Dahl was playing pedal steel and played a beautiful solo. Great use of wide and close intervals and very, very tasty. Well, one of my readers, he sent me an email and said, Mick, you show me how to do that? <laughs> so yeah, I can show you how to do that. So here we are. This is Wayne Dahl's uh, arrangement of Help Me Make It Through the Night. Wayne, if you see this, great job. I hope you don't mind me copying you. They say that uh, it should be the sincerest form of flattery. In this case, it definitely is. Uh, here's the first phrase. So as, a, as opposed to playing straight thirds, what we're going to do is we're going to play some, some close intervals here. At position number seven in the key of B, all major string groups give us B major. We're going to begin with a fifth on string number five. We're going to strike five and then four and six. Slide into the B pedal at nine. Now from here, we're going to raise both pedals, slide back to seven, and strike three and five. A and, a and B pedals, raise them, and then slide down to five and engage the A pedal again. Sounds like this. As we slide back to fret number seven, we're going to release the A pedal again. So what we're doing is keeping this note stationary. It's all about timing. Now this is string five and six. We're gonna strike five and six, slide to five, slide to two with the A and B pedals already engaged, release them, and then re-engage them. line. Starting at position number seven again, we're going to use strings three and five. We're going to slide to ten. Now while we're sliding, we're going to engage the F lever. We're going to strike four and six. Release the F. Engage the E lever. We're going to strike 4 and 5 and move from 12 to 10 and then back to 12 with 5 and 6 to 7 with the A and B and then back to 12. This is just an inversion change. Okay, so we have... play our counterpoint move, we're going to be begin with string number two lowered a whole step, and we're going to use our A pedal, so strings two and four are in unison at 12. But we're going to slide in from 11 to 12 with string two, then strike five, then release both lever and pedal. Strike four and six at 12. Slide into the A pedal at 14 with strings five and eight. Now I lost my place. So this is five and eight at 12. E lever, A pedal only, slide straight down. 
down to fret 9, slide down to 7, and we're using the A pedal rocking, and it sounds like this. Now that is our 5 chord, F sharp. This is string five, string three, step on the A and B, strike again, engage the B pedal and strike one and six, raise the B pedal and strike four and six, engage the E pedal, E lever and B pedal. Strings five and six. A pedal at five. There's your wide interval. And back to the B. Thank you all so much for tuning in, everybody. This is Mickey in Dallas, and I'll see you right back here with your pedal steel guitar. So long.